everybody. Thanks again for joining us here on Geek Tech Industries. Stick us here. Valley somewhere Valley behind here. me. And we are coming into the second elimination round. Oh, what's going on here? There we go. Second elim round uh, of the uh, day two of the extended tournament here at Kippers Malik. So we have Kalen and Jonas in the semifinals. Uh, table next to them, we have Mike and Zane. So, uh, of course, nice. Uh, Kalen, of course, rocking Whisper, Juke, Collision Detector, Darth Vader, and Hull Upgrade. Redline with Fire Control and Proton Torpedo. And Death Rain with Tragedy Simulator, Barrage Rockets, bo uh, Proton Bombs, and Seismic Charges. Jonas, of course, running uh, Kara, Para Jakku Gunrunners, an Outer Rim Pioneer, three Binary Pirates, and Drea Renthal. Fantastic, I love that. All right, there we go. We got the overlay all fixed up here. So we got numbers on all of the Jakku and Benares. Uh, we got Bob, the Utter and Pioneer, hanging out there. And of course, Jonas is rocking uh, Drea Renthal with Trick Shot and the Ion Cannon Turret. So we are coming up on one minute to the start. Oh man, I can't even right now. I have no idea. You guys have practiced a bunch against each other, haven't you? No? Like you said last night, practice. Who <laughs> <laughs> practices? Okay, take the word practice out and just replace it with play. There we go. Now when somebody finishes the damn thing, I'll actually get something. Yeah. You got into both of them, right? I told you they were both going to come up. There we go, my Jedi squad's gonna get ripped. Whatever. I contribute, that's all that matters. Yeah, yeah. You'd be like, so, oh, sorry, winners only in this car. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to go play a game with Scott, so you guys can shit talk Jonas for me. Yeah, um, we'll do that. And if anybody pulls Dre across the room, I am going to blind kick you in the face. Don't worry, Dre. All right, Dre. <laughs> 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 no I think it would be worth it just to see you try a flying kick. <laughs> <laughs> All right, X-Wing. We're going to get started on the timer, so you may begin. All right, gentlemen, I'm starting the timer up. All right, timer is good. These guys are down. They're just finishing their prep here. Good luck and good flying, everybody. I should go and get loop and chewy now, and then you'll salvo at the end, right? Oh. <laughs> no, I don't believe you can. I think it 
actually has to land on the table. I just, I just love that idea. Okay, drop it, I reload. <laughs> Let me check on that. Let me check on that. Yeah, it doesn't affect it. Yeah. No, no, because it's not an action, right? So. can be dropped with a portion of the token outside the play area. Ignore any portion of the token that is outside the play area. If the portion of the token is the entire token, you ignore the you whole ignore thing. You ignore the whole token. So you may have that action, sir. You are correct. I dropped a bomb for an action to reload my bomb. Maximum bomb. Yeah. Scum represent. Okay. It'll, the lock button will be grayed out. The join button will be grayed out. Double tap it and you will get in. It's weird, it's grayed out and then it shows. Because it hasn't, it will come up at, uh, at noon. It'll show up fully lit. But you can jump in early, yeah. But you can click it. Jonas already just turned all his ships about 45 and is getting ready to go wherever the hell he needs to. Think about your moves, Mike. You have to think about your moves. You can't just like random dial and slap it down. That's gonna be bad news. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, I know. Is you're that what I've been doing wrong for five years? Maybe. Oh man. Seems legit. bad when I can auto a squad that has like 20,000 more power than I do. <laughs> well, one of the things that's going on is remember that the enemy AI 
is dumb. basically it's on auto battle with no focus target. Yeah. So if you auto battle, you have the advantage over the focus target. They don't. 381. I've never gotten that low. Still a lot of jockeying for position here. Okay, <laughs> it's all good. It's just a little airborne. <laughs> Don't, <play it. laughs> Don't be a little on fire. Yeah. All right, so he's still running his red line up that far side of the board. Sharper, there we go. I like how every time we've had this Adarim Pioneer on the board, I've called him Bob. He's just Bob from now on. It's always Bob the Pioneer now. I still like Rim Bob. Huh? I still like Rim Bob. Rim Bob! Out of Rim Bob! I know, right? I know. <laughs> you call him Bob all you want, I'm calling him Rim Bob. Rim Bob. Because he's the outer rim. He's Bob from the outer rim. No, he does jobs in the rim. That's totally different. <laughs> hey, the, this is a geek tech event. There's no such thing as classy. <laughs> oh, low class. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. This is a tournament. You should already know how to play. <laughs> oh. <laughs> We're not teaching. <laughs> <laughs> if Bally hasn't dad punned you in some way, that's not the real Bally. You should kill him. <laughs> it's true. It's true. No, no. This is if the I evil was Bally. David, you wouldn't even recognize me. No, it's true. I look twelve. <laughs> I cannot get a beard and mustache to come in full, but I take whatever squatchy shit I can get because otherwise I look like a child. I'm with you, buddy. I'm with you. Uh, yeah, but and you don't look as young as I do, like you shaved I got asked if I was 17 when I shaved it off last, okay? <laughs> Still a lot of jockeying for position. Looks like Jonas is sort of splitting his forces in three ways here. He's going to kind of have a couple co uh, come through the rock, maybe. There was uh, no damage on that seismic, was there? No, I didn't think so. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> The rock took damage. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, Geek Deck. How's hey, it going? Hey, Ray. What's uh? How you crying, doing, buddy? Oh, crying my salty tears as usual. You know. Oh, it's like you got eliminated or something. Yeah, I know. Oh, yeah, you, you got eliminated. Oh, I did. I, yeah, yeah, I am. Yeah. Yeah. That's okay. Rookie okay. Ace can hang out and I, uh, I still maintain talk my shit about these guys. Yeah, I still maintain that rookie title. That's right. That's right. Rocking the rookies. You did okay, man. You did okay. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. You know what? Sometimes, uh, like, I uh, forget who it was, but the, you know, the guy that won worlds like four times in a row, once said, uh, "Sometimes all you can do is fly your best, and then just it comes down to dice, no matter what." Yeah, sometimes it's just dice. It doesn't matter how hard you fly when the dice are like, it "Doesn't matter." Not today. Yep. If it says not today, it's not today. That's it all. It really is. means it. Because yeah. if it didn't mean anything, then he'd probably still be world champion eight times in a row. Exactly. All right. So here we go. So, I, know, I didn't realize this this year, but you can see yeah, a big screen and a projector over there. 
Next year, next year, I'm putting this on the big screen. Yes, we. That is a phenomenal thing, man. Yeah. So now I get to sit here and uh, commentate with Geek Tech. Yeah. So we got Kalen on yeah. the left side, Jonas on the right. Jonah, cor uh, of course, with his uh, yeah. scum swarm here. Those are nasty. Uh, we got Bob, the Outer Rim uh, Pioneer. You know, I really was looking forward to finding somebody other than Mike. Uh, I was really looking <laughs> forward to the way it worked, though, right? One of those yep. seven ship lists because Nora actually would be almost immune to the two dice attacks, right? And to a lot of them, you betcha. To a she's lot just going to get that extra result a lot of the time. Yep. So the biggest problem is it's not the two dice attacks that are the problem. It's that reduced agility from that's the what quad well, That's what I'm talking about because Nora, she still gets her evade. She still gets the result. And she gets the result even though she's rolling no dice. Yeah. And so you basically have to, like, natties. To do any damage to Almost. her with these two shot with these two ship lists, and so you know I was um, I was kind of hoping to, to test my might against one of those awesome awesome lists. But there's always next time. There is. I don't know if I'm good enough to make it for these guys. These are, they're on a whole different level. Eric Kalen and, uh, and Jonas are just phenomenal pilots. My only uh, my only time I ever made to the finals was a. Uh, the, the final, the fourth round actually got cancelled, so I never got to fight Jonas. Never piloted against Jonas. I piloted against Kalen in the uh, regionals, and uh, even yep. though I went 4-0 with X-Wings at a regionals, wow, who does that? <laughs> I know, right? I got, I got knocked out. Because mar your margin wasn't high enough, was it? Yeah, because yeah, yeah. Kalen just destroyed me, and uh, that was the end of that. Yep. That ended my run. <laughs> <laughs> Sent those X-Wings packing. Yep. He goes, this so is for the oh <coughs> oh that'll be interesting. It looks like oh this seismic gosh. is gonna reach here. Oh yes, and these guys are gonna take some hurt. It, they will. That seismic is definitely reaching there, and there is going to be some. Now that said, yep, a little bit of splash shield, not so bad. That quaddy might actually be out of range. It'll be. In, uh, I'm, I can't really tell. From I know here. it's hard to tell from We're the camera. We're gonna need to get the template down in a minute once that uh, oh, the, the seismic rookie, goes off. The rookie says with his master eyes says it's in range. Rookie has the eye. Probably range. range, yeah. It has been forever since. Oh, jo I Jonas is pretty sure that that uh, that guy's gonna take a hurt as well. Oh yeah. So there'll be definitely some splashes there. I don't know if we had any other choices. I didn't see the initial setup. I just sat down now. But you can't well, put he, yourself he too far. Well, he kind of split his yeah. forces a bit. He had two and two and the three. And uh, these three were actually facing up the board on this okay. side, okay. and they came around this way. Turned in too hard, eh? Maybe right but this is what he does: is he splits them out yep. and then brings them back. And he doesn't mind eating that splash damage. No, he, he, that's minor you know because what? then he can just pour in all those two dice attacks. Jones right? was smart enough to know that that's what would have happened. And well, he knows. And he's expecting he knows. that he's asteroid to get destroyed for a clear run for his ships on the next turn. Uh, that's my thought as well: is that he's he's setting himself up to come through there. Yeah. Cause some bumps, cause some collisions, cause some problems. And that asteroid's not going to be there anymore. Nope, and exactly. it's worth it's worth the shield. Oh, and Whisper is just getting out of dodge, <laughs> which is the right thing. I can I can see Kalen pushing Whisper out here and coming yep, around to the absolutely. flank. Yeah, right. uh, for sure. All right, so the rock goes off. So that is five, yeah. seven, and four. I'll take one. So five, seven, and four. Four takes one, five takes a shield, and seven takes a shield. That is a neat program. I love that. Oh, this is super useful. Same, same, same website we're using to run the tournament. Oh, good. Cool. And this is all live. People uh, check the results live, or is uh, well, they could if we were live. Oh, we're not. Well, we're, we're no, uh, we we don't have good enough internet here to uh, actually stream. Uh, okay. The only thing, the only internet I could get here. Ex unless I paid mm, like more than $100 to the hotel for the weekend. Wow. Uh, it was going to be Shaw Open. Oh, okay. And streaming oh. on Shaw Open is asking for a problem. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, we got a proton oh, into number five. Into number five. Red line, throwing it in, no longer obstructed. Fire control on the blank into and turning it up. Oh, double crit, double hit. And Jonas busts out a single focus. Spend it and still take it. And so spent the focus. Is that five dead? Yeah, five is dead. Wow. Oh, well, that's that's the power of protons. The power of protons compels you. Whew. Wait, what? He does 
not get removed yet. Cause it's oh, initiative. at the end of initiative five. At the end that's of right. Initiative five. Which uh, interesting that Kalen makes that observation about initiative five with the new with new bigs, two point oh bigs. I oh. think is superior now. Yes, I think because even if he's bigs. dead, yeah, if he's not removed yet, you still gotta pour I more damage into him. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I know he's fan fantastic. Oh. Now. He can definitely steal more damage off. Oh, the, and uh, a juke. So shield down and a crit on seven. Fuel Ooh. leak on seven. Ow. Ow. Oof. That could have been worse, but it could have been a lot better too. Kalen has some incredible dice luck with those protons. When you have focus target lock. Focus target lock. Yeah, it's, focus it's target it's lock, fire control, it's pretty pretty so solid. Back in my day, when I used to when I used to calculate all those things back in my day, yeah. on a four dice attack, because I was a huge ghost fan, yeah, yeah. and the focus target lock was an 89% chance. Yeah, yeah, of getting your four. Getting your four. Yeah, yeah, it's it's a really or seventy-nine good. something like that. Anyway. It was it, could be wrong. it was more than two, more than three quarters of the time yeah. you were gonna get your four. Yeah, you had yeah. Because each dice individually is a. I 50, think your 50. most common result would have been was three. Yes, three was. Uh, but there are good odds for four as well. Yeah. Maybe uh, yeah, maybe I was thinking on three was eighty-nine and four was seventy something. Oh, go Bob, go Bob, Bob. Go Bob. Bob is gonna. And Bob, Bob, Bob is out natty. Bob is busting out the natties, but one evade. Oh no. He's just making focus. There you go. So Bob, was that one hit on red line? One hit on red line. Or death, death rain. Oh, and that's one of the torque scans. Wow, oh, and he flung, them. you flung both seismic, don't you? Uh, I've reloaded one. Oh, but you realize, that's right, you flung one and reloaded immediately, because, <laughs> Jake! <laughs> yes, that's what I, that's actually the advice I gave to Mike as well, is uh, fling, reload, fling, reload, because he's fighting seven quad jumpers there on table he's two, gonna right? He's going to need them, so he's going to need them. Just fling, reload, into fling, reload. Target. Red line. Oh, or into death rain. There we go. Oh, so, somebody's still beeping. one shield left on death, uh, death, death rain, right? <laughs> oh, dang it. There you go. That's enough. It's enough. Yeah. Especially now that Epic's kind of out of the game for a while. Yeah. <laughs> no, never. Yeah. I miss Epic. I'm sad, Panda, that we never had an Epic tournament. But dude, you just swept it. <laughs> That's why I'm sad we never had an Epic <laughs> tournament. I developed a really good list. It came with a lot of practice. So now they're go. All right, so they're setting dials. So it's just a fuel leak on the one. Yeah. Save uh, on Bob. I'm on the you let Mike win. You know, I I, I, I let him I let him win. I decided that with three range one shots on a three hull death rain, with wedge, no defense dice, I would only do two damage. Yeah, well that was very kind of you. I was very I mean, kind of you. You, you just decide you've won enough top places and I to give someone else a chance to win. Well, I would have I probably would I would have been smoked by either Jonas or Kalen because they're. You know, if they go to worlds and national stuff like that, yeah, I'm, I'm just local guy. Yeah, yeah. As, as, as decent as I do locally, I don't think I would do very well in the uh, in the international circuit. But yeah, you know what? If uh, to who I lost to, I'm actually glad it was Mike. Uh, it's ha I'm happy to see him here in the top four, and to to give those uh, Vancouver boys a run for their money. Yeah, he's the only one of he's, our Victoria still our, in it. He's our last representative. He's our last hero, Obi Wan. <laughs> And, don't uh, don't tell him that you called him Obi Wan. Yeah. <laughs> Oberon. <laughs> there, there you go. Taylor there you Oberon. go. At least. 
At least it's something. <laughs> it's a little closer, I guess. <laughs> He's also a very good pilot. He is actually. He's very. Uh, he he's aggressive, and that's what I like. I'm an aggressive flyer. Uh, he still has all the ships on the board. I can see that on table two, so that's a good thing. He's flying against seven quads, and he's actually doing rather well against them. He did some proton bomb flinging, got some serious damage into a group of four quads before any fire even got exchanged. Nice. So he's off to a reasonable start. And but so now I those quads are closing distance, and no tractor beam shenanigans is going to get going. You know, it's it's a one whole sh it's a one defense based ship. He's not sacrificing a whole lot. He's basically sacrificing one evade every three rolls, like mathematically guaranteed ish, right? One evade guaranteed ish, eighty percent of the time. Well, in my time. on my match when I fought him was a hundred percent. <laughs> Salty tears, I know, but it, was, it literally was 100%. I wish I was exactly. That's the luck of the dice sometimes. Yeah, absolutely. Right? Yeah, I was just telling uh, Stickus that. It doesn't matter how good you do sometimes, and even people at Worlds acknowledge that. It doesn't yeah. matter how good you fly. Some, if your dice are going to go on you, that's it. There's nothing you can do about it. No matter what, there's an element of luck here. Yeah. You can only fly as good as you can. Uh, but that speaking, I still made, in my mind, some bad moves. And Mike flew very, very well, and he earned that victory. He did. He did. He did. Because you had a reasonably close match. It was a very close yeah, match. It was only like 10, 20. You want something? <coughs> Surprise me. I don't know. If I'd have killed Death Ray, I would have won. Yes. But yeah, and that's... you had half on it. Did you? I already had half on it. Yeah. yeah. It only had like three hole left. Yeah. Yeah. It was a close match. Your margin was about 30 points. You something just like that. Yeah. I needed to one more finishing blow. I needed blow to finish or... off Death Rain. Because then I would have had two extra turns. Maybe you might have been able to turn in and kill Whisper, because I would have had all guns bearing on Whisper. Yeah. And he's as good as he is, as good as Whisper is, when you got... Pretty vulnerable nowadays, those Phantoms. If they're not uh, cloaked, Wedge and down uh, to two, ad two defense dice. And Wedge and Nora, Wedge and Nora can do a lot of hurt to Whisper. Oh, Wedge yeah. and Nora can do a lot of hurt. Oh, if hey. you can slam your Intimidation Arvel right into her. Well, you know what, my Arvel... Wedge shot. <laughs> oh. speaking, of, speaking of dice, my Arvel died on round one of the game. What? Yeah, range three shot, obstructed, four dice. It was against the Torp, and I blanked out. I had a focus token too. Wow! I rolled four blankies, wow. and he rolled hit, hit, crit, crit, and there goes Arvel, pop, one shot. Holy smokes. I never got to use Arvel throughout the whole game. I don't think I've ever heard of a round one popping of a ship at Yeah, well, three. I wanted to really get him in there fast and block, and I figured I'd probably post up by the asteroid, which was obviously way out of range of a bomb at the time because he had to move, and and then knowing that Mike was going to be aggressive and also follow up with a range three move or a three uh, move on his uh, punishers, I would just weather that first torp. Incoming shot. And yeah, weather the first incoming shot. Oh, yeah. And it did not happen. Didn't so work the way you wanted it no. to. No, and that's fine. You know, I got uh, zeros. All right, I'm back. Excuse Grab my back. snack. What did I miss? They're just uh, moving their ships now. So okay. yeah, maneuvering. Oh, proton so out yeah, there, we got eh? the we got the proton out on the oof. system phase. Oof. So big oof for sure. Uh, we'll see how it goes. That is gonna hit at least two, and it looks like it might actually no, it's soak gonna, Bob too. It's gonna it's gonna soak Bob. It looks a long ways away, and that one is actually going to be close. But the um, the rookie eye still says it's gonna hit. I'm I'm reasonably certain Bob's gonna soak that again. I mean, bad news for Bob, but good news for Kalen. Yeah. And that's why these guys pilot at Worlds. Yeah, these two are some of the better pilots we have in the uh, in the geographical west. Area. Yeah, the geographical west area. That's why they end up on top table all the time, man. Yeah, well, there was the one tournament there that I, well, two actually that I won um, mm -hmm. when I played Empire back in the day. Um, oh, back in the day, yeah. Back in the day. Uh, actually, Kalen was in that tournament, but I get, he lost his first match, and he was hoping to submarine up, and it was only a top four. Actually, no, there was no cut. Actually, there was no cut. It was just, just only like, it was just there was pure Swiss round. And I actually ended up winning that one uh, um, 
Michael Carpenter came up with me on that one. Yep. And then uh, this, the other one that I won was with uh, Andrew, and Andrew and I was up there. So, but other than that, my other showings in in Vancouver, well, they've been okay, but never won them. And now here we go. Seven oh, goes. Seven goes. Seven is done. Wow, that's some amazing rolling, man. Seven Those. Took a, and uh, you took a shield on death rain, right? Is that shield down? Yeah. Four takes a crit. And Bo what's, how's Bob? Was he in reach? No. Ah, no. Bob was not in reach. Rookie was wrong. Well, that's why I'm here. Jackie's gun runner number four took panic pilot. Panic pilot. And so there's that. I'll remove that at the end of the round because panic pilot actually flips down immediately after you get yep. the two traps. So. Oh, that's your. Oh, yeah, that's right, because it's purple. <laughs> I have a bunch of Punishers still in their boxes. I should unpack them. That is a phenomenal list. Well, you know, you can give them to me, and it's surprising. <laughs> <laughs> well, now, given their popularity, I actually. Uh, and I'm, I'm a bomb fanatic. Like, I was a rebel bombardier. You were a brutal K Wing flyer for a while. Holy shit. I know. And I was the only one with a. No one I know ever had a bombing ghost. <laughs> I, was a, I was a ghost bomber. <laughs> that was the thing in the wider meta. I know. It never really caught on here, yeah, in, I know. Uh, here on the island. Fire control system and he rolls wow. into a Hit blank. Crit, crit. He turns it up for two, single crit. That was number three. What was that a, what was that that he hit him with? Disabled power right now. Wow. On number three. Number three, he took one there. Brutal. And that was the proton from red line, oh, and he's, right? And he's returned fire and he's getting hit, hit, hit. That was the proton from red line? So he's out until he reloads now. Yeah, one ion and a damage on red line uh, well, or on death rain. Oh, barrage oh. rocket on Bob. Bullseye. Barrage Bob in the bullseye even. Focus it up for three and Bob natties it. Go Bob. Bob lost his shield, but he still got one, right? Yes. Yeah, that's what I thought. Go, Bob! Bob taking his shot. Range two on Death Rain. He's really pouring the shots into Death Rain here. He's still got uh, one of the gun runners. Gun runner number three and uh, Venary number six are right there as well. Another damage into wow. Death Rain. Death Rain down to All four right. hull. And uh, re roll for a single crit, and there it is. Another, oh. Damaged engine. Damaged engine. Ow, that doesn't go away either. Venary number six is taking his range one from the look of it. Oh, is it two? There we go. And the reroll for hit, hit. And Death Rain's like, I like that. I like hits. Hits are good. One hit point left on Death Rain. Yeah. And, uh, and the number four is already shot, right? Yeah. All right, so that is end of round. Oh, man. Wow. All right, that changed a lot. Now, J Kaylin is still ahead on the points race oh, right yeah. now. Absolutely. Yeah, Scott uh, Roebuck in the uh, preliminaries. Hit me, hit 10 well, numb with a uh, damaged engine. He's like, sure. <laughs> so what's that, Bally? This is the second time now that these two have been faced against each other this tournament. Yes. It is. So hopefully Jonas has had an opportunity to learn from his previous match against Caitlin, and he approaches it a little bit differently, maybe. And we'll Jonas see. is laughing, going, learn. 
<laughs> Obviously, he heard my comment and he thinks I'm foolish. He, he just randomly sets dials and puts them down, like, just like the rest of us. Come on. Oh, you mean Death Ring keeps it? Yeah, yeah. Quaddy. Quaddy's ionized. Oh, yeah, he has to ion uh, ionization move. Then he cleans it, exactly. You want to hear about unlucky in a way? In a way. In a way. Um, Nora uh, ionized an individual. Yeah. And then I rolled the crit for the ion crit, so it didn't matter. <laughs> just added another ion. Oh well. They, they just they moved, and then the ion they went away, and the crit went away, and it's just like nothing ever happened. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it's just oh like oh man. my god. Now, hold on, Gunrunner number three doesn't get the ionization until he activates, right? Yeah. Oh, okay, so it's now, okay, yeah. 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 Well, so technically it's not there yet, but it will be in a moment. It is there, it is there. He performs an ionized mover. Yeah. Oh, that's right. That's, uh, it was just one of those lucky situations where I ionized an individual. That and then the crit that, that came up was like, oh, it doesn't matter. That's exactly <laughs> right. Like, oh, man, you can't be ionized. <laughs> oh, that's frustrating. It was. Well, I don't know about that, but it was it was funny because it was one of those situations that, like, had to have the, the ion first before the crit, and then the crit meant nothing. Yeah. Okay. So he's dropping behind. And then he's moving forward. So bank one. So he drops the old uh, proton. So one more proton bomb off of. Uh, don't know what number that is. Death Ring, yeah. Disabled power regulator is been flipped down. Yes, and uh, Death Rain just dropped his uh, proton. Death Rain doesn't have a proton. Oh, proton bomb, you're right, there. Right. Yes. And have you. Is that both protons gone, right? Both protons are gone. I want seismic and recharge mode. Yep, there we go. Yeah, and you, and you still need to reload on Redline? Did, relo did Redline reload yet? Okay. <laughs> You're like, this is fine. <laughs> is fast and furious here now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, I think things are starting to turn. I uh, I love the addition of the system phase for bombs. You know, it, it, it bombs and stuff, a bunch of stuff in this game just felt tacked on and like <laughs> bolted onto the core game, and now it is part of the core game mechanic. Yeah. Which, super, super new. Just the addition of that single phase has completely changed the game. Absolutely. Because it would give high PS bombers now a severe tactical advantage. And now, now they have to do it during the system phase. Yeah. Now you still do it in uh, pilot initiative order. Correct. So you still go lowest to highest. Yes, that is true. Um, but, now but it all happens in the one phase. And then everybody moves. And then everybody moves. I like that. 
that even if you get ionized now because it's part of the system phase and has nothing to do with revealing a dial, you can still bomb. Yeah, it's not about revealing a dial, it's yep. not taking an action, you can do it stressed, it's great. Yep, just bombs. I'm, I'm so jealous that Rebels don't have bombs right now. Huh? Rebels don't have good bombers right now. Well, you know, I think the K-Wing is still a good bomber. It just, it needs somebody to just figure out how the hell to fly it right now. Maybe I might revisit it. I, th I think you could probably do well. But the thing is... Now, the biggest thing uh, is uh, with no TLT, yeah. you don't have a lot of reach like you used I to. I don't. Uh, and, uh, oh, there we so go. So number six takes... End of activation. We got a bomb. So six is not quite. Nope, yeah. just out. Wow. So, but number three takes a crit. And number oh. four takes a crit. Right, and then... <laughs> Saber battle regular again. Oh, man. On number three. He is just having a bad time. Oh, for one more? On number four. That's what he pointed oh, at. Oh, wrong one. Uh, number three is uh, still at four health, right? Uh, no. no, number three has one, two. Oh, that was number three, three that you hit, wasn't it? Yeah, they both oh, took wow. a crit. Uh, who took the disabled tower regulator? Three again. Okay, <laughs> I thought so. So he's at three health. And number four had panic pilot? Number four had panic pilot, yeah. Now he has uh, restabilizer. Restabilizer, okay. And he's at three health. Yeah, there you go. Uh, uh, three health. I think, yeah. Whoa, blanks out. Jonas yeah, blanks. Yeah, brutal. No evades. And that is number four has been killed. Yeah. Boom shakalaka. Yeah, Drea next. Oh, look at that. Yep. So he's going to get the uh, turreted shot there. So hit crit. And one of eight, so one crit into red line. Ah, finally taking some damage. When a one agility ship contingency rolls evades, it is very, very tough. Death Rain. Uh, firing into uh, what is it? number six. Number six, okay. With Natty's. And, and blanks out. And blanks out. So shields down. Shields down. Wow. Lost out yet, but Kalen is definitely pushing the points race. being ionized again the, the good news is he just has to do one maneuver to clear all of them now yep. but there really isn't anything good about being ionized no no there really isn't <laughs> Not drop any bombs on this system phase. Nope, just decloaking. Just decloaking here first. I don't know how many times I've forgotten to decloak in uh, a tournament setting. It's just unbelievably embarrassing. Oh, I know. And I'm going to guess the way he's decloaked, he's setting himself up for a hard. He is going to push through and use his. Uh, yeah, so there is that disabled power regulator gone. A collision detector to go over that rock to get some good quality shots unless he does a hard one that's always possible but 
with uh, with collision detector still having two charges, and he knows those guys are going out there. I foresee. is thinking really hard here about his actions and what he wants to do and how well, he wants to who he wants to activate first I can see away there on the other table Mike still has all his ships on the board yeah it's, that looks like a hell of a battle over there to be honest I only count five uh, tugboats on there I either I would laugh so, so goddamn hard if it was like Whisper Red Line Death Rain versus Whisper Red Line Death Rain again. Yeah, they would be a rematch. It would be another yeah, no, the rematch because Mike has played them. Yeah, Mike has played uh, Kalen before. And uh, Kalen beat him. Yep, and that was Mike's only loss in the uh, round robin. It was. Or the yeah, Swiss rounds, round? I should say. Yeah. <laughs> round robin. There's 20 people. It's a round robin. Holy jeez. That's geez. an all day. And that's a half an all type day. Thing. <laughs> that's two days right there. Well, we'll have 10 rounds on day one and 10 rounds on day two. You know what? We should have a, like a Le Mans tournament. I'm, I'm I got plans. Trust me, a I Le got Mans plans. tournament. Just do like 12th entry Le Mans. You do 12. You, just, you play 11 for rounds. 24 hours. 11 rounds. It would be pretty close to it. Yeah. Yeah. Number six is very weak. He only has two hull. So he's gonna Vader, Bob or. Vader Bob. Bob, and he's gonna see if he takes spends that token or not. He he's is gonna remove the token. Removes the token. Well, Bob's still rocking that shield, but it's he not, needs it. It's not gonna keep him alive that much longer because now he's. So Whisper is shooting, and yeah, but Whisper just don't two. Get the rerolls. Yeah, no yeah. fire control anymore. Mm -hmm. on Whisper. Whisper no. can't shoot anything. Whisper 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 can't shoot anything. Number six is dead. The last six, ben, eh? the last Benar. Pow! Benar is gone. Just flat roll, flat roll. Bob, one hit. And Bob's like, yeah, I got my evade. I'm good. Yep. Bob's got this. Yeah, man. Bob's gonna be like the last ship, and he's just gonna clean up. <laughs> Suddenly a big shark fin grows out of his back and he like rips uh, everybody. When I fought Mike Messiah at one of the Gauntlet Games tournaments, he had his uh, decimator. Yeah. My Z95 actually did nine damage to his yeah. decimator and, and stayed alive. You bet. And I killed his decimator. Well, so you know what? Dodge, right? Anything so can, exactly. That's three. Ooh. Oh, oh one damage ion on Death Rain. But also gets immediate shot back because... It's all in initiative five. Yep. Oh, wow. And one on Bob. Go, Bob. Natties Go versus Bob. Natties. Natties v. Natties. All right, well, Death Rain is down, which gets Jonas on the board at least. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> You've not tabled. You got the bomb off the board. You still have to deal with ports, but the bombs are gone. Finally. He hasn't, I don't think he's reloaded his, uh, oh no, he, eight yeah. proton tarp. Okay, I missed that earlier. Wow. I heard that. Do you need some silver spray paint over there? <laughs> Witness me. <yeah. laughs> There's now only four quads on the board there up in table two. Yeah. Yeah, there's uh I still see shield still got Yeah, I still uh, see shield tokens on some on of his board. ships there, so. And, uh, but I see one, two, three, four. I only see four quads. That's quadies. what I said. Yeah. I said I only 
pretty beat up over there. Wow. Mike, what's going on over there, buddy? Got some early round proton Showing him the might of the Empire? <laughs> he got some early round proton bombs right on top nice. of some clusters, quad jumpers. Nice. Oh, that's nice. So I'm glad to. Early the lack of shields is just causing those quaddies lost. And then early proton is nice on a ship with no yeah. shields. I don't think Nate, Mike needed my advice on that on proton reload, proton reload against he those knew. unshielded he knew quads. What to he do. knew what to do. That's just why he's his there. first rodeo. It's not even his like third rodeo. No, that's why he's there. That's why he's there. Hard earned victory. Crushed the rookie, crushed the rookie, and now he's. You had it, it coming. <laughs> I had it coming. Yes, I had it coming. It's okay. You know what? I won. Uh, I won the EG one. I got 50 bucks and some swag, so I'm good. Yeah, not bad, man. I won tournament one. I'm good. <laughs> That's it. I'm done. You're like, I'm a tourney winner. I'm good. I'm just gonna rest on my laurels now for the rest of the day, rest of the year. That's it. <laughs> like woohoo! Well, not I a lot of year left, so. <laughs> Although there is another tournament coming up. Uh, yeah, at, the 17th. Uh, EG November, I just saw so. that on 17th. Eh? Hopefully, I'm still around for that. I can never decide to commit to a tournament right away because duty watch schedules, sailing schedules. I know, it's just you like, being yeah. in, the in the military makes it difficult sometimes to commit because you don't know how it's going to yep. go. Yeah, right? just, I just go like the week of, then, I'm, then I'll, I'll know the so week of. So number three backing up. Yeah, he backed up. Bob uh, getting the hell out of there. Bob is as fast as Bob can, which is not really very fast. That is. If that's all they do is three straight. I don't know oh, what the dial is. It is a shit dial. I have never looked at their dials. It is. There's a reason they're only 20 points. Oh, they tore. Yeah, they're 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 like a shuttle. Like the yeah. sheath of peach shuttle, you're saying, right? No, no, the lambda shuttle. Oh, the lambda shuttle. Okay. Yeah. I was gonna say because. She's but the they're also and small and only four hit points. Oh, so. Yeah, I was gonna say because the attack shuttle has a decent dial. I wasn't. I wouldn't. Yeah, because it's an attack shuttle. I wouldn't be dissing the attack shuttle, and, but but if it's the lambda shuttle it's, dial, then it's, it's really back. similar wow. to the lambda shuttle. Almost like K wing style, even <laughs> just uh, just a bunch of banks yeah. and no ability to turn around. Sort of. Ooh, but look at that. Kalen wasn't being well. He wanted. Uh, he, he knew. He, he knew. He wants, dead Bob, <laughs> he wants he Bob dead. Oh, Vader into Drea takes her first shield down. Oh, range one in Oh, he's not even he's not even finishing Bob. Oh no, he wants to get some shot. Oh! Broke is up for two, and Drea's like. Oh, and he's gonna juke one down. Oh, does he spend it? Yeah. He's no, not he gonna takes, spend it, he's gonna take that other he shield wants, and he wants hit. to ionize Whisper badly. He does, he really does. Oh uh, I guess maybe he knew he was taking a proton there. Probably that laser. Oh, snap. Three hits and a crit. Drea is gonna turn it up for one and take, take three. three. Oh, is that uh, panic? Wounded pilot. That's not bad. All right. That could have been a lot worse. Getting blinded. So we got Drea checking her range with an arc here. She's on red line. Yeah. Wow. And so that is one and an ion, is that right? No ions? No, because oh, you evaded one. Man, when those when those punishers roll and evade. When those punishers roll that one evade often, it is it is actually it's punishing. It's it's good. It's really the reason why it has one evade is because it's not meant to really evade, but when they start evading, if they're all on the rolls. Dude, that's a lot of damage mitigation, even for, you might think, oh, it's just mitigating one. It's got a lot of extra holes, so it's mitigating a lot more than one. Yep. It's worth its weight in gold when you roll of eight for one of the no, ships. I agree, I agree. Why, I just, I can't stop saying good things about Nora. <laughs> Double of eight. So the dial's down, they're just, so they're just thinking hard to see if they actually want to commit to him. Thumbs up from Jonas. We got a Whisper D Cloak off to her port side. Yep. I, 
guess it's a space navy. They would probably use ports and starboard side. Oh, they totally would. Yeah. Well, and because left and right are relative, port and starboard are not. Correct. Yeah, well, yeah. Uh, I wonder what, I guess maybe because of a three-dimensional space, maybe they might have something different. Hey, Bob. Uh, <laughs> Bob. Maybe. Get out of there, Bob. You can do it, Bob. Run, Bob. <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, go Bob, go! Nice, I like that, I like that. Tractor beam 5K. Yeah, as much distance as you could possibly put I know, on. I, that's nice, I, I like, I really appreciate that? that you can wow. tractor beam your friendly ships and fling them a bit further, right? Thank you for showing me the power of that. Right? Wow. That you is the other, that that is the other thing with these gun runners is you can be like, nope, fling them out of the arc. The look on your face right now, Ray. You're going <laughs> revelations. Yeah. Revelations. I can hear the gears turning. Like, maybe I'll play some scum after all. No, no, it's just going to make me more aware when I play against them. Yes. I'll never, I'll never play or, or, I mean, you might think twice about putting maybe that tractor beam cannon on when you have a couple extra points, right? Yeah. Might be useful after all. Well, yeah, like T-70s now have a weapon hard point. Do they? Which means... Proton, missile, or beam weapon. I haven't seen the T-70 uh, spoiler yet. Spoilers. I don't spoil myself. They have a, <laughs> uh, yeah, they have a weapon hard point like uh, the uh, C-Cats, like the M3A. Wow, okay. So you get, yeah. it gives them a lot more flexibility in their armament. See, I I don't even go on the Reddit sites or nothing. Like I don't. No, this is from their. Uh, this is from the uh, spoiler article for the. Or uh, even that T seventy X wing for. Like uh, after like the first like release. four or five months I, when I was playing when I started this game I don't I don't look anything up online now. No. Until it comes up and or people talk about it at tournaments. You don't even want to know. Huh? That's the first time I hear about it. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh snap! Turn it up for hit crit and a juking. Oh! Hit crit on. That was on number three. And it was a weapon fail. Got one health left. You have a single die attack. Hit crit. And he spends the focus. So hit, hit, focus crit. Up. Blank oh, blank skis. Up. Dead gunner runner number three. It's down to Drea and Bob to bring this home. Just a, a friendly reminder to all the equity players going to the bar. They said it closes at one. That is your main one preference. Yeah. Last call for alcohol. <laughs> yeah, nice. Back up, oh. back up there, a little bit more. Not quite range for Bob. No, Bob was just That would have been nice to get those couple of other hits in on red line. Oh yeah, and red line has uh, 75 minute rounds, man. It's that odd number, you know? Even, uh, even if Jonas takes out red line. If Jonas no can take out red line, it's still not it's, enough. Yeah, it's still not enough. That uh, Whisper is full health, full well, mods. Honestly, that is a hell of a point sink on Whisper with Vader and the Holic Raid. Like, yeah. But Kalen, being a world's competitor, he knows what he's doing with that Whisper. Yeah. And yeah. that's probably why he put that whole upgrade on it, just to give some extra survivability because... Well, it lets him do things like, you know what, yeah. I'm going to take that damage and use my focus on attack instead. Yeah, just that one extra could survive him much an extra round. Yeah. Well, it also means that... Um, I mean, he still takes the same amount of damage to get to half, mm -hmm. which is three. Yeah. Uh, but then he's still got that one extra hull to hang on to, right? So. Yeah. Oh, Bob. No, I don't know. Poor Bob. Poor Bob. Don't be like Bob. <laughs> That'd be a real Bob move, Bob. <laughs> so. He figures uh, Red Line's going to finish off Bob, and Whisper's going to come in for Drea. He's going to attempt to Vader Drea. Nope, nope, out of range. So now we got Red Line. Oh, we got Whisper, Whisper into Drea. And Drea. 
One, one hit, and Drea's like, I got the evade, Jukin, and they spend. There you go. Come on, Bob. Wow, oh, hit crit, hit crit it up, and Bob's enough. like, I'll take a crit. This one? Stun pilot. Drea, gonna feed a couple more shots here. One hit. Or was that one hit? Nothing? Yeah. Nothing. Blanked out. Bob, go! One hit. And, and he goes. evades it. Oh! Yeah, that red line has been rolling all evade. Oh my god. That's bad news. That is bad news. On those big ships like that with that one evade. You well, one agility, I mean, you don't want to see a lot of evades. That's just he's nasty. Gonna, he's going to cater in that ship. He's going to cater in that line. And it's possible. Yeah, because Bob has to move first. Yeah. yeah although, Whoa. keep in mind, Bob's got to stop. Oh. I think Bob's going to stop. Now, I don't know if the stop is actually going to block the cater in line. Yes. You think so? Yeah. Yeah. Because if K turn four, it might. K turn four, okay, yes. might. But Too then Whisper's going to swoop in. But yeah. That depends. Is Whisper swooping in, or is Sw Whisper going after Drea? If I were, if I were doing this, I would. Oh, I would decloak forward two with Whisper and turn one. I would stop. I would stop Punisher. Uh, yeah, because Punisher has to stop as well. I would stop the Punisher. No, you know what? The Punisher right now, Redline. Eh, I don't want to. I, I wouldn't want to take any more damage on Redline. No. Um, I, I, would I would. I would bump and let Whisper finish off uh, Bob. That's interesting. Yeah. Force force Bob into a bump situation. Yeah, force Bob into a situation that he literally can't get out of. And, and we called the stop. Yeah, called it. There's the stop Ola. And I'm guaranteeing it. There's Andrea. Doing a bang yeah, one. Clearing the stress. stress. And focus focusing up. up. There he is, focus up. Get a roll and take a damage. Or take a stress there. Take a stress, yeah. He keeps getting that stress though. Yeah, yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> that wounded pilot is brutal. Uh, yeah, there was the decloak. Yeah, and see? Oh, okay, well. See, you definitely learn from the last go at it. It's better than what it was before. Got half on red line. Drea's gonna burn off that focus from Vader. Yeah. He. Drea can't really afford to just go down to one hole for free. No, okay, range one. Oh boy. But it's. Yeah, it's and, like. And, uh, yeah. Two and bam. That's it. So is that three? That's lethal. Yeah. And because PS5, she has removed. And then I uh, go down to Bob, who may or may not have range there. Oh, your uh, your app, your app doesn't have their initiative values beside them, does it? Oh, it does say in in five. Okay, that's what that is. All right. So that was nothing. Big old nothing burger. All right. So now this is where Bob is gonna just like shark it up. Bob. Wow, you've almost used all your freaking damage deck. That's amazing. Oh, he's got four cards left. Wow. What happens if you build a list that has more than 33 health? You simply can't damage anymore. Yeah, I don't know. It's weird. Like, what happens when you run out of damage cards? You don't take any more damage. Right? No, you recycle. <laughs> <laughs> no, those technically all go to the discard pile. And when your deck is empty, you reshuffle your, into your discard pile. I think so, yeah. discard into your library. So. Um, not they that that really comes up often. No. It's definitely not going to come up here. No. <laughs> Bob is healing out. Oh, and there we go. Red line is just banking out. And Whisper's going to finish off Bob here is my call. And he's reloading, I'm guessing. Yeah, here we go. Our turn. Yeah, red line reloaded. Red line reloaded. There yeah. you go. Not that he's going to need it, but... Bob's got this. 
Bob got this. Everybody in the X-Men community right now Everybody is loves cheering Bob. for Bob. Go, everybody, Bob, go. Everybody wants go, Bob, Bob to survive. Go. Bob survive this. I want to see Bob survive this and then paste okay. Whisper. <laughs> Bob's got this. Bob's going to natty. <laughs> you don't think Whisper's got this? Uh, oh, troll y'all. He's not even getting Oh, <laughs> he's Jonas gonna, just he got. He really wants that proton kill, man. Jonas just got mic dropped. Oh, my God. Oh my God. On stream, too. <laughs> Kalen's just like, I'm finishing this with a proton. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, mill that deck, damn it. Deal those last four hits. <laughs> it, it twitched again. I shot it. <laughs> Whisper, one bank. There we go. Boost it up. Boost it. There you go. Oh, one forward. Oh, that will give him a hard turn and line up. Dang. Yeah. Because he's, he's imagining where Bob's going to be. Yeah, because it's range control there at that point. If he'd have banked, he's not bank. even going to bother. Oh, but Bob gets to shoot. <laughs> Bob takes four, a shot. Five dice? Four dice, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Kalen's like, Whisper's not going to kill you. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, that's so beautiful. Wow, he's getting rickrolled on screen. I know, right? I know. At this point now, Kalen's just trolling him. Prolonging the egg. Right? Jonas is like, just get rid of my last four damage cards already. Just make me deal them. Challenge accepted. Even if Bob somehow got like a range one, all crits, Still couldn't do it. Couldn't, couldn't do whisper. It. Nope. Or ooh, might with all crits on red line if there were a couple of direct hits in there. But he's got to survive for it. <laughs> and now whispers range one behind him, and this red lines range two in front of him. This is it. They're both initiative Bob, five. Bob is like, I'm praying to all the force right now. Yeah, he can't Vader because if he Vader's, he doesn't get yep. to shoot. So now they're both and initiative five. Whisper is. And there's three into Bob. And crit. That's lethal on Bob. But now Redline's going to overkill. And that's it. He empties and the deck. that is that. All wow. And empties then we the deck. extra card. Yeah. Woo! Jonas now has to and pick up all. There's another one. So <laughs> right on. Kalen advances on to the final. Kalen versus Mike, a rematch of the Swiss it's round. It's looking like Kalen Mike, so yeah, so we got about 10 minutes left uh, in regulation time Punisher on Whisper. Matt, uh, number two over yeah. there. So, uh, alright guys, we'll be back in just a little bit with uh, wow. uh, the final. Thank you for having me, and I'll let Valley go back into the final, and I'm going to watch. Yeah, yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. Leave some comments in the comment section down below. Check out our Patreon, patreon.com slash geekdeckindustries, and we'll see you on the map.